It's because this nigga want everything to go right and it's the first time. You gotta knock y'all niggas control you gonna be in Yo, bro, I feel like every time that I fucking wipe something off, something else fly out of nowhere. You gotta knock him, bro? You just, you bring the table to a hot shirt. You want to get some fresh air and come back. Yo, roll a split, man. Nah, don't smoke it, bro. You gotta be sober, nigga. You can't fuck with the word. Nah, this nigga has to relax. He has to move. You supposed to be here? To the first episode of In the Loop, the podcast. We feel like everybody's in the mix, but not everybody's in the loop. The purpose of our podcast is to keep you guys in tune with things going on in the urban, mainstream, and underground world. Today, we're going to focus on a lot of stuff coming from fashion, sports, music, anything crazy that we should talk about, we're going to yes, talk about it right. here. I got me, of course, Stacks, Shot by Stacks. I got my wonderful co host to the side have. of me. We got my lab. other co-host right here, though. Bettina Marie. Shit, huh? Got my guy right here. Fever balls. Joe. Big man. We got our audience over here in the cut. Yeah. Give it up for our audience and all that. Let's get the audience. Let's get it popping on. There's been a lot of crazy stuff going on in the sports world right now. We got Kyrie, Kyrie Irving, and Kevin Durant to the Brooklyn Nets. We need another round of applause for that. Shit, can't I ain't gonna lie. You better live your best life. No, so that's what we're saying. I, we really wanted, I really wanted Kyrie and KD to go to the Knicks, the New York Knicks, but since the owners of the Knicks, they couldn't um, guarantee Kevin Durant the max contract because they felt like his injuries might be a trouble in the future that he just um, suffered an Achilles injury. So that is a big injury to come back from, but... That's KD, so I feel like he's gonna come back from that. But um, the Knicks didn't want to give him the max contract, so basically, the Knicks lost out on him and Kyrie because if if he went there, Kyrie was going with him too. Kyrie was going wherever he went. That's why Kyrie went to Brooklyn, and they both signed four-year max contracts for like 142 million or something like that. But KD's only gonna play three years out of that four years because he's gonna be out the whole next season because he's injured. Word. So he's basically getting paid. 141 million for three years. And they're just hoping that when he comes back in 2021 that he's just good to go and that the chemistry and everything will be good. It is it is risky, but the Nets got nothing to, to lose, you feel me? Yeah. Because they haven't won anything yet. Um, we also got Kawhi Leonard, the Finals MVP that just won the championship, went to the Los Angeles Clippers, not the Lakers, LeBron, damn. <laughs> Damn, Brony. We feel me, got on um, Kawhi and Paul George. So Paul George, yo, nobody want to stay with Westbrook, bro. Like, that nigga oh, is no, like, he's like, he's like, he's like, he like, he like a cancer stick or something. I, don't, like, I, I can't call it. Yo, man. We got Lil Bro in the cut, too, man. Can't forget yo. Lil Bro. We got Bro here. What? Oh, he left out of bed. How you feel about, how you feel about that? Kawhi and the Clippers. I know you don't really care about basketball. I know you a DJ ass nigga. I know you don't really care, but, Yo, you you just won a championship on the team, right? You didn't even want to go there. I respect it. Mm -hmm. And it's like you want to go to LA. LeBron Fina for you to come to, to come to the Lakers. And you go to the Clippers. You a real nigga, right? I'm not gonna cock suck and go on LeBron team. I wanna play against LeBron. It's also too, like, what if he got a better deal with the Clippers? You know what I'm saying? He probably nah, got more. The Lakers right. was both they both was giving him that max. They giving that boy whatever he wants. So maybe saying, you know, it could always be business, cause we never know. But I would say maybe 
maybe going to the Clippers is going to give him a shot because LeBron is already the star of the Lakers. We got LeBron and Anthony Davis is on the um, Lakers as well. Anthony Davis from the um, the Pelicans, he came to the um to the Lakers as well. So if Kawhi went there, that'd have been three superstars. So that kind of would have been a lot. Right now in the NBA, it's like a lot of duos. There's no more super teams. The Warriors is finally. Like somebody else got a chance to win now. So I'm hype about that. I'm kind of mad with the Knicks though. The Knicks let me down. Um, oh, yeah, I feel the same way about the Knicks. The Knicks, oh, the Knicks. Yeah. Even my, even my, from my audience is like, yo, the Knicks is letting us, the Knicks letting us down, right? What we, oh, I, don't I don't know what I, we going. Like, I feel the same way about, I wish they went to the Knicks. Yeah, the I feel down. like Brooklyn, look. We we I we all based in the Bronx right now. Brooklyn is lit. I got love for Brooklyn. Brooklyn be having the web series. Brooklyn got all the rappers coming out of there. Y'all got the new. Y'all got the Barclays. And y'all got fucking KD and Kyrie now. Like y'all took they took over New York. Like the Knicks. I don't even know what to say to the Knicks right now. But for me, basically basketball is gonna be lit. Basketball is gonna be lit 2019, 2020 season. So we looking out for that on the sports tip. Um, as far as the entertainment, we had the BET Awards just just passed. Word. I'm not gonna lie, I'll be flopping on the BET Awards. I don't be, I didn't, I wasn't gonna watch it. Like I ain't gonna, I didn't really watch it like that. I watched it when it came back on, cause I seen the Graham go crazy. They was like, yo, it was lit. The Cardi and Offset performance was lit. Jack Meek Mill was crazy. Meek shit was crazy too, right? He bought out Harlem, he bought out Eastside Ferb. He bought out Ferb? Did that? You watching the beat? You know, I didn't see it, but I watched like the reruns on YouTube. The only thing I remember seeing was how you be called out somebody. Like, she called out somebody? I ain't even seen it. I think she called out spicy on, shit? on Lil Nas X. Oh, that honey lit? Oh, shit, what do you mean? Honey lit. Yo, man. What's up, everybody? Everybody, um, I think so. <laughs> now, I, personally, I didn't even watch the BT one. So you watched it? Front. Nah, I seen a few performances. I remember DJ Khaled's performance. That's about it. I kind of felt the type of way because they didn't bring J Balvin out on that song because I feel like because he was Spanish and it was the BET Awards. You feel like because uh, he was, like like he was Spanish, they didn't bring him out, or he probably was busy, but I feel like he was busy. Nah, yeah, like you're on a track. Yeah. So I kind of felt a type How of way. How the fuck he ain't come out? Excuse my, my French or whatever, but we being real. How he ain't come out? I thought. And I think I think um Khaled did the um thing for Nipsey too. RP Nipsey Hustle would be great. Yeah. The late great entrepreneur motivating me and my yeah. parents right. to even want to yeah. do entrepreneur things. RP Nipsey really a tragedy. As speaking of Nipsey, Nipsey did get best male artist at the Hip Hop Awards. I feel a way about it only because he, I don't know if he would have got that if he didn't pass away. Right. Now Nipsey is a great artist and. He has a great catalog, and some people might say he doesn't have a hit or whatever, but he does have hits and he does have quality music. And I feel like, I just feel like the love is always there when it's too late. At this point, you, you know? At, at this point, it don't matter. We're doing it for respect. Right. At this point, it don't even matter. What he stood for is what, is what we really what we do. Yeah, and we get the music at this point. Right. Nah, I, I respect that he too. He was a hip hop artist. I, res I respect that too. I feel like they doing right, but I just feel like they gave, they gave him that a little too late. They also gave him the humanitarian award. I felt like that. I don't want to say that was too late because they usually get that to you kind of like when you're like older. Nip Nipsey was only 33, so I feel like him dying made them kind of rush to give him that, seeing all he did for his community and for others. So I'm not gonna knock the humanitarian award. Um, so. I respect that. Lil Baby got best male new artist. How we feel about that? How we feel about Lil Baby in here? How we feel about Lil, Lil Baby Burger? Lil Baby or the baby? Who we got pick at? Nah, baby. Wow, baby on the rip? The baby's still fresh. That's hard. Nah, 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 Especially on his songs for with Son of a Vegas, all of them shit sounds. That was his. That was his take. That was. What? My, mm. Oh, cause I'm not really, a, I'm not really the baby fan like that though. I don't, I don't know what Son of a Vegas is. I, I, I like his music is good. Yeah, like yeah. Bro, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, it's it's young CEO. Cool. I'm a young CEO. Sure, man. I like that part. It's that part makes a lot of sense. sense. I'm not gonna lie, that part makes a lot of sense right now at this moment. Like, but. Right. Nah, shout out to the baby and Lil Baby. I feel like Lil Baby take it home. That's male new artist. We gotta give it a round of applause. Lil Baby been putting in that fucking work. Shout out to Lil Baby. QC is just super lit. QC, 
they lit. City Girls is lit, even though JT is still booked, but young Miami, she out here doing this shit for both of them, which is, I feel like if I got like, if me and you, if like, if me and you a team and I go down, I'm gonna be crying and shit, nigga, boss up, like, go out there and, and keep doing what, and I'm gonna be home in a little bit, like, she's coming home. So like, don't just stop the boat, you know? Don't stop. What's that new shit? Like, let me try. What's that? I, don't, I didn't mean to get into that right now. I'm sorry. <laughs> what is that? Megan what? the Stallion shit. She's fired though. Whoa, 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 whoa. What is? What does that mean? When you, I guess, when you drink in a street or some shit like that. Yeah. What's the, <laughs> All right. So, so when you drink it straight, that means let me drive. You driving the boat type shit. <laughs> I don't know. It doesn't. I no, no, I'm just trying to figure out this shit. Like, I don't know how she came yeah, up with it. Not nice. Am I tripping? Yeah. Yo, I don't even know. When he was on his All right, let's, let's, let's let that marinate. Let's take a five. Let's, 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 let's let that marinate. Let's take a five minute commercial. Let's, let's hear some music. Let's chill out for like a little bit. We'll get back to that. Driving the boat. Let's hear some music. We back. We back right now. We talking about a cucumber. <laughs> Nikki, help me, please. What's the what's this cucumber thing? Don't talk about. Sucking cucumbers like they're dick out here, baby. It's just crazy. <laughs> it's the cucumber challenge. And yeah, bitches are wildin', like. Wasting cucumber. I ain't gonna lie, bitches are showing their talents though. I wish I was born. All I gotta say is just have that I same swear. energy when I'm in your DM. Like, Yo. ah, ah, that's what you get. You feel me? Don't don't be Hollywood. Nah, I'm look, in your DM. I look, never look, see you with a violated cucumber. Like, I mean, <laughs> I want slaughter the shit, right? Fuck the cucumber. I need parts. Like, I, I ain't gonna lie. What was that on Facebook? The gram? She was in the car. She had two cucumbers. She was going crazy. Like, going crazy. She was going eight. Like she had. I'm sorry, guys. She, I'm sorry, guys. She had spit on it. She was spitting on the cucumber. I'm not gonna lie. I love females, but the female species is is like I'm. They be audience. What are they? Different. They different. But we love them. We love females. Do you understand? But. They're different. Um, that's just some of the things that's trending. So we got the cucumber and we got rock the boat. Are there any other trending things that I'm not? Drive the boat. Drive the boat. Yo, Drive the boat, but nah. Rock, rock the boat is dope. Feel me? Right. That should be when you drink yeah, it. Yeah, you feel me? Rock the boat. Yeah. <laughs> That makes more sense. That makes more sense. We might have to make that. Thank you. I think we should drop. That's in the loop. That's a that's in the loop. That's in the loop. I like that. Rock the boat instead of instead of drive the boat because it you know sense. a girl she gonna, she gonna drink that honey straight and then she gonna rock the boat. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> that, that, what else is trending that I don't know about, Sam? Please tell me. I know you out here. You out here in the streets. You out here. What, what's your? What's you mean the loop? What's your name? Ahead, you to say active dancing is just trending right now. Active dancing is really trending. I know y'all seen that viral video of them dancers dancing the toast. Yo, if, you, if you don't know about the active, if you, if you don't know about the active dancers, go on, go to Instagram and go to active dancers underscore J A. So the active dancers are based from Jamaica, and they nice. They've been doing this for a long time. They just went viral. Um, I believe they they had like a um a little interview on on stage TV or something like that. On stage is a very it's a big platform Not for, like you know, for, no, for, you know, dance hall and reggae artists. You know, the video that went viral for them actually hit at least, like, 7 million views. You know, 7 million? Yeah, just a couple of days. Because we need, we need 7 million. The main video did, like, 5, mi did like five million. There was another page I posted that, that got, like, a million on it. You get what I'm saying? So it was on different, like, it was on different Instagram pages and all that shit yeah. going viral. Everybody that Hot 97 posted it. Hot Yeah, they posted it. And this too, is like, this is Jamaican dances, like they they dance into Jamaican music and, and, and stuff like that. There's a lot of New York shit too, though. Um, shout out Tutu. They got the twirl. That shit. Tutu Tutu G's. Like, we got we the got twirl. the Miyagi. Shout out my man Bug Out Rob. Like everybody uh, doing their own little uh, thing in New York. Shout I'm smoking. You know what I'm saying? I'm smoking. City road to the ball. There's a lot of stuff out here that's hot right now. No, come and come and meet the one. Know what I noticed? <laughs> you see how the oh, self man. got a sound? You got Eli in the back. <laughs> Yo, Eli, where you at? Got a sound? Yo, the South has a certain sound. 
You feel yeah, me? We got New York is coming together. Yeah. It's a big day. Now we have a sound. Speak we up. A sound. I want to make sure it's, it's Harry. Speak up and right. We had a sound yeah, originally, yeah. but it's different now. And I'm done. For a while, the yeah, South was taking over with the music because they, they came with the dance. They right. came with the different energy. Now we bring you back the energy. You got to do this. Pay attention. To yeah, that. nah, I'm not going to lie. I feel like talking about the East Coast, like we coming back with that energy, right? Big facts. Like we, we do, cause like you gotta think about like the South, like even with the Migos and like, and all that. And I I think it was, who made the dad? Who made that? Uh, it wasn't Migos, bro. I ain't gonna lie, it's a lot of people. Rich so the mean, Kid, Jack It was P. like, Rich the Kid, but it was like P.B. Longway. Future. Future. Nah, I don't know. So you said PB. Future. <laughs> you went like long. everybody went crazy That's with the long, names. Long, I know. Long way. Long way. Long way is in that. Long way is the Migos in that loop. Long way is in the loop. Not though. that I know. I'm just that telling you, like old videos that I seen, you like said. Future. Yeah, Future. I never even seen the dab. I don't even know if he could do it. Like, <laughs> I'm talking about his flow. I thought you were talking about the down south. Flow. Oh no, no, no. We saying like you see how like now like the East Coast we got a lot of we got a lot of dancing now. We got the twirling yeah, and I I, for, for example, Bobby Smurda had the Smurda dance and all that. But I feel like like down south they had the, 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 the rock. They had the that de- leave with it rock. That's why it's a throwback. But you're right. You right. Come on, you should be. Yeah, thirty. Come on, that's that's so boy, boy, No, 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 no. I'm sorry. He's true, but I'm saying like as far as recent. Ones. Okay, the dab. Okay, okay, okay. You understand what I'm saying? I mean, New York is always the. Man. I feel like we got that sauce with the dancing. Yeah, like, shout out to all them get light people. You know, kid the way, kid the way, kid hat. Shit, baby. Yeah. 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 Y'all personally know me, but I'm shout to y'all. You know, y'all niggas <laughs> kept it up. Y'all doing it. Y'all kept going, and it's 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 all P Nipsey because it's a marathon. You know, and, 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 and right. it's like it's not a race; it's a marathon. Y'all kept going, and kid the way, and he's he very fond of him. He's doing good. So you feel me? Um. I want to kind of get to like, like we've been joking, like a serious topic. We got earthquakes going on and and, um, from New York, and Cali though. Words. No, no, I'm saying you got the, um, the, the earthquakes in, in, in California yeah, or whatever. I think that happened yesterday or something. It was like two of them drones though. You know, some crazy, man. You know, um, Cali set up on the San Andreas Fault, you know what I mean? So uh, earthquakes are really yeah. always prone to That's normal to them. Yeah, I was just about to say that's that normal. to them is regular. like, But like, that's scary. That that is scary though, but to have two in one day. That, but I feel like they said like it was like like four point something and stuff like that. A normal, I, I, they had bad. they had a six. No, no, no. They had a six something. They did. So they kind of said that like they're used to it, but they weren't used to like that one. And they even they had to stop the basketball game. It's, it's, been, it's been a while since they had a big earthquake yeah. like that. You know what I'm saying? You feel know I me? Mean? They say that's over with. Like they they got. And you know, California, Vegas. That's that's a real attraction to go go on a vacation and go smoke and go enjoy yourself. And you know, imagine you smoking and you just go, yeah. Right. I'm gonna look at the weed like, 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 like imagine you, uh, Latina, imagine you high and then the ground shaking and you shaking and everything shaking. Remember the first little earthquake we had though? We did have some little shit though. We didn't know what to do, like. Jesus, you more here. Hurricanes over here. Hurricanes crazy. Y'all remind me when that, Sandy. y'all remind me when that little earthquake we had at once. No, no, not hurricane. I mean earthquake. Wow. Oh, that was like so loud. Earthquake? Yeah, it was that many, but... Right <laughs> <laughs> I remember that. It was funny. Yeah, my friend told me she was on the toilet. It was some big, like, it was like a seven, six. I was locked up, but I seen it. Nah, it wasn't even that dark. I don't even remember that shit, to be honest. I remember. Niggas were scared. I remember. I remember is blackout. I don't remember. Yeah, that yeah, was a classic. Oh, was it? Uh, what? It wasn't. What? It what you were doing? That? The French was, was like everything was bad in the car. outside, bro. You was the uh, crib was bad. Like everything was off. Feel me? So I don't know. You got talking about this heat wave, man. Yeah, it's so um, hot and humid shit. outside. Well, I feel like every year get hotter. Hot yeah, that shit kind of got me like, yo, I kind of rather this heat. I rather the heat. And then, then uh, I'm, 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 I'm your no, 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 no. I'm saying, you see, like I gotta finish, but I, I opposed to earthquakes. I'd rather be in New York with the heat and shit. Oh. Then I live in California or in Las Vegas, and I'm worried about fires. They be having mad fires and shit too. Like yeah, then the fire hazards and then the earth. That's a matter of fact, since people was people, since people don't let me finish, would you rather be in New York with the heat wave or in Los Angeles with earthquakes? Free. Man, I'm from New York, baby. He's scared of an earthquake. He yeah. wanna be here. I'm scared of an earthquake too. I ain't trying to. LA, what you doing? Earthquake. I don't know, bro. Honestly. What? 
What if you having sex and an earthquake happened? You're not even going to care, right? Yeah, I'm going to keep on going. So now this is right. We about to, yeah, we about to go out. Stopping. That's what I'm thinking. I'm stopping. I'm getting up. Stopping like, what? You getting up. Shit is getting too stopping crazy. Stopping what? Like. We about to die. This is, <laughs> I'm a guy, like, this, <laughs> this, this is how we supposed to go. Like, it's only right. Shit, man. Why not? <laughs> Straight like, shit. I want to die. So I want to die. Why not? If I'm gonna die, I'm gonna be smoking a blunt or in some way. Right, they gotta be the Yo, my man's well, in the loop, they saying that they wanna they wanna die in the pussy, you feel me? Especially Especially if you love free the sluts. Free the free sluts. If if an earthquake is happening and I'm in some pussy. This could be the last time. I'm about to back out the pussy. I'm about to, you know, I'm about to get even deeper in this shit. Crazy. Oh, 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 Yo, active dancers, they've been dancing for over. I need I need my audience in the back to, to, to lower it just a little bit. Thank you guys years. so much. I love you so much. Lower it a little bit back there, please. Active dancers, they've been killing it for over 15 years in the dance hall. You know what I'm 15 saying? 15 years? Over 15. And they just going viral? You know what I'm saying? They've been doing this and they done did similar stuff to this, but never nothing to this matter. As a matter of fact, that's a good thing to get in the loop real fast. If they were doing this 15 years ago, right? Mm-hmm. When they was doing it, it kind of, that was harder to come up than now, because now it's like, like you said, they did go viral, and we happy for them. They viral, they lit now. It don't matter about the 15 years. It was a long run, and they lit now, and that's all that matters, but it's just like, it was, it was it's, it's easier now to, to get popping, right, than it was back then. Yeah, because yeah, the platforms you got. Definitely. You know, and the, and the craziest thing about it was, it was that um, our aunt's repass, you know what I'm saying? It was just... I'm sorry to hear that. I'm sorry to hear that, bro. You know, mm-hmm. RP to my aunt. Oh, condolences. You know what I mean? She passed away from cancer. And it was after the funeral that they were dancing at the repast. And, you know, they weren't even recording themselves. It was actually somebody recording them. They recorded, somebody was recording them on Facebook live. And I don't know, somebody took the video. Wait, at the passing? Yeah. Oh, somebody the cropped the video. At the bottom. And, you know what I mean? And posted it up. And just like the, or just like the, the clippings of it. And that shit went viral. You know what I mean? And from there, I don't even know who reposted it. I don't know who posted it. Thank you to whoever posted it. You know what I mean? I appreciate it. And it was just going. Yeah, it was just, it was just going like from there. And I, I woke up. I personally didn't even know the video. I seen the video, but then my cousin called me like, yo, save that video. Like, download it. You know what I mean? Take, like, put it on your phone because it's only on Facebook. I'm like, all right. And when I checked it, I'm like, yo, this shit passed a million views. You know what I mean? And then from there, shit just kept going up and just a mat- within a matter of like four or five days. Yeah. Nah, that's that's super cool. And I feel like on In The Loop, we want to like, we want to have fun and drink and, and smoke and like talk about stuff like that and current events going on. But we also want to like something like that. We want to get more conscious and just show like how a bad, how a bad, something bad, because his aunt did pass away, like a bad and a good could happen at the same time. Like it's like like a blessing in disguise. I, I don't want to say it like that. I'm sorry about, you know, y'all. I, I'm not saying it like that. It's just that she passed away and it's like, yo, they was having this, you know, cause like, you know, somebody passed, like we sad and shit, but we kind of do want to yeah, celebrate. Yeah, and yeah, they was right. dancing, you know, they was giving that dance. I actually want them to dance and shit, that shit went viral. And that shit did five million, seven million, all kind of millions. So it's like, in life, man. So it's like, in, 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 life, in life, you gotta take the good with the bad, you know, like some, something bad could happen. And then something good can happen right away, so I feel like you gotta just stay. Like, what if they want to dance that day? For real, you know what I'm saying? You feel me? Everything. Like what they said. We ain't dancing today. Everything she was dead. So, everything you know happens. What I mean? well, that when a baby's born, that's new life for somebody else. You know what I'm saying? When somebody passed, that's still new life again. You know what I mean? Life is a cycle. We don't stop with none of us. We all gonna pass away one day, and people are still gonna live on the earth. So you know, it's just it's just a blessing. You know what I mean? And, that just shows you that there's a higher power there too. So people gotta be aware of that and be conscious of that as well. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. Like even even hearing that, that's real stuff. And I, I hear that song you playing. Can you turn it up a little? Can we just vibe to that? Can we, can we get a little positive? Let's, let's catch a vibe. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so we're back. I feel like we had a a fun, informative 
episode, we, we cover some topics. Um, we got a lot of people's perceptions. You know, we all letting out our perception. That's another acronym for loop. You know, um, you can look forward to a lot, a lot more content coming from this channel and from the podcast. You know, in the loop, in the loop TV is gonna have a lot of stuff, web series. We're gonna be doing um, solo interviews with upcoming artists. We're gonna be doing video shoots. Freestyles. We're gonna be doing a lot of stuff as well as the In the Loop podcast. Um, once again, I'm shot by Stacks. I, you know, I'm, I'm nice with the camera. I'm out here, we out here making moves. I got my co-hosts. They doing their things. You know, they could say what they got going on and stuff like that. So just stay tuned for In the Loop. Um, I'm LA Sab. I'm an artist. You know, um, for y'all that don't know, I um, from Harlem, New York. You know, I do music. You're a big artist. <laughs> you just trying to, you know, yeah, where, for me, where they, where they, where they get, where you at? Like, where they can reach you at? What's your gram and all that? Instagram, I said LA Sav, LA Sav 1090. So that's LA Sav 1090 on Instagram and all that. Yeah, where, Instagram, they, where they can find your music and everything like that? My music, my Apple Music, everywhere, Spotify, um, SoundCloud, YouTube, my YouTube, LA Sav. Um, we working, we just, you know, coming from, I have a story that I said. Come from where we come from, the trenches. Trenches, you know, the bottom of the dirt. You know, trying to be mud. You know, get out the mud and all that. It's hard for us, you know. Yeah, facts. So, and it's just in my message. We just trying, you know, we trying to send the right now. Just like whatever you doing, you could do it. Like you feel me? Like, like put your mind to that put shit. Put your mind to it. Whatever you could do, like. We all know each other from, you know, real shit, like. Forever, yeah. Forever, this, this like. Is, my calls, I know all my calls are very long time. Look what you doing, you feel me? You doing something positive, bro. Yeah, DJ, we all, we all yeah. doing something, like, and it's good to see that, like, to see everybody want, but that's the whole point of my, my purpose of me rapping. My message I'm sending and shit like that, you know? That's a fact. Hey, just just find just right, you can find right. all his stuff. LA just type in LA Sav. That's YouTube, Apple Music. His once again his Instagram is LA Sav 1090. Oh um, Bettina, you can let us know what you got going on. So my name is Bettina Marie. I have my own cosmetics line called Flutter Butter Cosmetics. I do all things beauty. I do right. eyebrows. I do makeup. Black <laughs> <laughs> And it's like flutter, F L U T T E R. Butter like the butter you spread and cosmetics. Right. <laughs> Support that black business, man. She's smooth. She's smooth. She's smooth like she took it slick. And when we got. You, we know, shit, talk good. DJ Fever Boss. Mm-hmm. You know? Big money. Bow, 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 bow. Big money. Yeah. Yeah. Instagram yeah. at Fever Boss. Yeah. Facebook at Fever Boss. Twitter mm-hmm. Fever Boss. YouTube Fever Boss. Everything at Fever Boss. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And you don't know. For bookings, you can book me at bookfeverboss at gmail.com. You know what I mean? All young artists send your music to my email. You get a message. Yeah. Every song is a hit song. We can make it a hit song. So right. you want, if you have a song and you feel like says it, just email Fever Boss. Thank Book Fever Boss at gmail.com and we can make your song a hit. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. And, yeah, and, and when, you, when you book him, just know that um, he's not cheap. <laughs> just, just, he's, he's not cheap the same way that um, our wonderful photographer and videographer um, behind the camera, David Benjamin, is not cheap because he's about his business. And I just want to shout out David Benjamin. You can, you, can, you, can, you can reach him, David Benjamin, on Instagram or whatever and see his work. He's behind the camera shooting this podcast. Once again, I want to give a shout out to my lovely co host. Let's get it. And my audience, we lit. We in the loop. Let's get it.